Dozens of candles lit up the Ogle County Courthouse in honor of a mother and son. Today, people remember the lives of Maggie Roscoe and her son Amos. 13 News reporter Cassandra Roberto shows us how the community's love and support will continue to keep their memories alive. Candles, pictures, and stories. That's how community members remember two lives taken too soon. And you know, every time we come and we start talking with people, we learn something new every time. Mm -hmm. Somebody will throw a memory out and you're like, oh my gosh, that was so Maggie or so Amos. And it's really good for us to hear that because um, it helps us kind of keep them alive. Keeping them alive is what family and friends say is their goal. Maggie Roscoe and her three-year-old son Amos were killed three years ago to the day. Roscoe's ex-husband, Dwayne Meyer, is charged for their murders. Justice is going to be served now and uh, just having family and friends surrounding them has got to give them some sort of confidence to go forward at this point. But even during times of tragedy, family, friends, neighbors and community members are still keeping their memory alive by remembering the joy they brought to others. That's a testament to the people they were, you know, especially Maggie, what a bright light. Amos lit up her life and so seeing those images and seeing the joy in their life, you know, it does pass on joy to others. Friends say Maggie loved being a teacher. She easily made friends and when she did, they were friends for life. Friends say Maggie had a powerful love for her son, Amos. He would go, Mama! And he would run right to her classroom mm -hmm. and she would scoop him up and just her eyes would be so bright and she'd always have, you know, just the biggest hug for him. It's great that everybody has got this memory and they got together to keep her and Amos alive and at the end of the day. It's, it's wonderful, it's overwhelming to tell you the truth. And Finding light in the darkness Maggie and forever keeping about, that light um, shining bright. For your 13 Weather Authority, Cassandra Brettel, 13 News. Now, a foundation was created in their honor of the mother and son called the Maggie and Amos Foundation. Their goal is to provide scholarships and grants for the future educators in schools in our area.